Hello, 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 guys. It's Brenda Douglas, and I am here with your leadership tip for today. Listen, surround yourself with leaders. Surround yourself with people who are positive, right? The people who you spend time with impact your life. They affect your mood, right? They they influence the outlook of your life, right? So you want to make sure to surround yourself with people who support you, people who believe in you, and people who want to see you grow. And we can all sense when people genuinely care about us. We can all sense when people are trying to help us, right? So I want to encourage you to to surround yourself with good people, right? If you, Denzel Washington once said that if you hang around five confident people, you will become the sixth, right? And then also John Rowan said that you are the average of the five people you spend the most time with, right? So guys, you want to really take this seriously and you want to be selective about the people who you bring into your life, right? If you want to grow in leadership, you're gonna have to surround yourself with uh, people who are leadership. Like, now let me just say something about leadership. Leadership, uh, any and everyone is a leadership. I'm sorry, is a leader, <laughs> is a leadership, Lord Jesus, right? We are all le leaders. Now, why do you say that, Brenda? I say we are all leaders because we affect people, we influence people every single day, right? Now, some people influence people for evil and there are evil leaders. And then there are some people who influence people for good, right? You decide what you want to be. At the end of the day, we all influence someone, right? But listen, if you want to grow in leaderships, like I said, surround yourself with great leaders, read books about leadership, read, um, read, uh, uh, watch movies that may um, inspire or, inf or show you examples of great leaders, right? Um, one of the things I notice about uh, when I talk to my brother, my brother is also um, a supervisor. He also manages people just like I do, right? And so the conversation is very different um, when we're talking along those lines, right? We bounce ideas off each other. We discuss what's going on in terms of um, managing people and how we can each grow and do better, right? So the conversation is very different, right? Great minds discuss ideas. Eleanor Roosevelt once said that great minds discuss ideas, right? Average minds discuss events, right? And then small minds discuss people. So pay attention to the conversations um, when you're with people. What are you talking about? What is the dialogue, right? Pay attention because as I stated before, you're going to have to be selective if you want to grow in leadership. Now, that doesn't mean that you think you're better. It doesn't mean that you don't want to, you know, you reject them people. It means that you want better for yourself and, and people should want better for you as well, right? It just means that you uh, want better for yourself. Some people you have to love from a distance. Some people you need to create a little more space. The point is you just want to be selective about the people who you allow in your space and you want to pay attention to the dialogue or what has been discussed so that you can evaluate um, you know, where are we going with this uh, conversation? And is this is this conversation going to make me a better person in the end, right? Surround yourself with good people, surround yourself with leaders and surround yourself with people of diverse perspective. But like I said, people who will help you grow, right? You want to spend time with people who fit your future and not your past. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful to you. Go ahead and move forward and be blessed. And I'll talk to you soon.